Stephanie Norman, Register of Deeds for Burke County. The Burke County Register of Deeds Office is excited to announce that we are transitioning to a new software system through Courthouse Computer Systems. To assist you during this transition, we have created an online web training video with step-by-step -step instructions on how to navigate the online land records database and vital record indexes. We ask for your patience during this transition, however, we do encourage your feedback so please do not hesitate to contact me directly or any of my staff for assistance or if you have any questions. Thank you. This is a demonstration of the new functionality available in the Register of Deeds office. This is the new public search site. The new site appears similar if you're searching inside the Register of Deeds office or if you're accessing the information remotely from across the internet. The interface is a tab interface, meaning that there are different sets of functionality available underneath any of the tabs. If you know a particular book and page number of a document that you're looking for, you may find it, you may find it by going directly to it. By this, I mean you just need to type in a book and a page number and the image for that document will appear. The other traditional method for locating a document in the Register of Deeds Office is to search the Real Property Index. When you're searching the Real Property Index, you are applying filters. When you search the Real Property Index, you are applying filters. You are narrowing your search based upon certain criteria so that you are targeting only information that you are looking for. You may enter as much or as little criteria to define your search. The more criteria you enter, the fewer search results will be returned. In this particular case, entering in wells brought back over 10,000 search results. Defining that further to Wells Fargo has reduced the number of search results returned to under 10,000. By default, by default, we are performing a search both on grantors and on grantees. We are searching a mixed set of results. So both permanent records as well as the most recent temporary records that have not gone through the entire quality assurance process and are maintained in a status of temporary until the QA processes are complete. By default, we are bringing back both firms and individuals. We are bringing back records from, from we are bringing back records from all book types. And our results are being returned in traditional style. Traditional style of search results mimic index records pairing one grantor with one grantee in the traditional method that has been used since the days of paper indexing. If you prefer, you can decide to have your results returned in directory style. If you choose to have your results returned in directory style, a listing of all of the names that matched your entered criteria are displayed along with a count of the number of instances that name was used. You can always get from directory style to traditional style by selecting the names that you are interested in and coming down and filtering by those names. I am entering a from date in order to filter my results even further. At this point, my results
Take two. At this point, I am entering a from date to filter my results even further. With the from date of 07-01-2017, the only results that are being returned to me are those from recordings made after July of 2017. Anywhere that there is an icon, it indicates an image for that record is available. Double clicking a search result will automatically take you to the View Images tab with the image displayed. You can always easily get back to your search results by clicking on the Real Property Index tab. Oftentimes, you may be targeting a particular document or group of documents. In this instance, you may select the records that you are interested in by going through the list. You may filter your results such that the only results remaining in your list are the search results that you are interested in. At which point in time, you can double click to pull in the first document and use these buttons and use these buttons to move from your first document to your second document to your third document. So only displaying to you the images for the documents that you're interested in. By default, search results are returned in an order prescribed by the North Carolina Indexing Standards. However, if you prefer your results to be ordered in a different manner, you may click on a column header and sort in either ascending, the triangle will point up, or descending order. If you would like to print your search results, you have multiple options. You may print page or do an advanced print. If you choose the advanced print, you should experiment with the two different styles for printing search results. Both styles are unique and have their own advantages. By default, we are returning 15 records per page of search results. Use the orange arrow buttons to navigate through your search results. If you prefer, you may increase the number of search results returned and scroll vertically through those search results. The default search is a begins with search. In this particular case, searching on the name Smith is returning results, of course, for Smith, but also Smitherman and Smithy. If you prefer to only search exactly the criteria that you are looking for, type it. If you prefer to search on an exact name, choose an exact match search and the only results returned will be ones that exactly match what you are looking for. If you need to conduct a search on older documents, that would be documents that were recorded and indexed prior to the Register of Deeds Office having a database system, you may search the old index book images via the second tab. In this particular case, entering a name will return an image where the index information was typed into a book 
That book was later scanned. Searching on the name Jones brought me to the section of the grantee index for this particular date range, 1979 to 1988. From here, if I want to go directly to that document, I can enter the document information and be taken directly there. You may maintain information on all tabs at the same time. You may have information available on all tabs at the same time. Just click on the tab tops to navigate between the different tabs. The vital record search works exactly like the land record search. You may choose to search all vital records or narrow your search specifically looking for marriages, births, or deaths. Once again, like the land record search, you may return your search results in either traditional or directory style. In some instances, you have subsequent documents that refer back to previously recorded documents. Here is an example of one document that is referencing a different document. The references are links. Clicking on the link will take you to the reference document. Reference links go in both directions. So you can go back and forth between documents that have a relationship.